Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to dive deeper into the concept of Action Chunking Transformers or ACD. But first, let us understand why ACD is needed. The most popular imitation learning algorithms are trained using expert demonstrations. The policy tends to mimic the expert's action based on the given observations and input. This approach works well in most cases. However, when dealing with robots that have lower precision, the robot cannot reproduce the exact output for a given action. This discrepancy causes the robot to reach a different state than intended. With each time step, this error compounds, eventually leading the robot into a state that was never previously encountered during the training. This out of distribution state results in the failure to complete the task. Action chunking addresses this issue by predicting the future key actions from the current state rather than just one action. So instead of relying on all the states, we rely on the states after every key steps thereby reducing the compounding error by k-folds, although this turns the solution into an open-loop system, using it along with temporal ensemble makes it more reliable. While using temporal ensemble, the policy predicts the next key actions at each time step. The temporal ensemble then aggregates these actions using the given formula. This formula prioritizes the oldest action as it has the highest probability to get us back to the required trajectory. The oldest action is favored because it was generated from a state within a distribution, making it more reliable. By using temporal ensemble with action chunking, we significantly reduce the compounding errors that occur in low precision robots, ensuring they stay on the correct path and successfully complete their task. That's all for today. Make sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel to get the latest updates.